All right. So, uh, hello. Hello. <laughs> it's nice to see you guys. Um, if we could just start by having you uh, introduce yourselves and tell us um, a little bit about what you do. Well, I'll turn the camera so you can see <laughs> both of us a little bit better. Great. Uh, my, name, my name is Carrie, and our business is The Painted Garden. And I'm Mike. Nice to see you, Carrie and Mike. We're husband and wife, um, and we've been in business together for about 27 years now. I saw that, you guys. This is your full-time gig. Yes. This is our full-time gig, and we haven't killed each other yet. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. So what do you guys do? So our, our like I said, our business is the Painted Garden. Uh, mm -hmm. We paint on slate tiles for garden products. It might be better to just to show you the product rather than describe it. This is true. Yeah. Um, Absolutely. So real quick, we're going to show you an example. So I'm going to take you outside so you can kind of see what our product looks like. Okay. It okay. goes into a garden stand. Uh-huh. And here's another one. We, we designed the garden stands just for our slates. All of our slates, we use an exterior enamel paint, so they are meant to go outside year-round. You don't have to spray them or seal them. And you just slip out your slate and slip it right into the stand and put it out amongst your landscaping, and you're good to go. I'm going to uh, switch that around. Want to walk? Yeah, so here, I'll, I'll walk with you. <laughs> <laughs> um, so Carrie's mom did this for 25 years. Um, and then she kind of handed it over to us. So it wasn't our original idea, but she never had uh, the garden stand. Um, we use a different type of uh, slate material. We actually get it um, from another country, um, which she was just using uh, that were reclaimed and she was getting them locally. Mm -hmm. um, our our slate is probably, a, well, it is a higher quality. Um, so yeah, that's kind of how we, we got started. We, we both went to uh, college, that's where we met. And um, we tried getting normal jobs. Um, uh -huh. And uh, we, we both really weren't happy or satisfied with that. And so um, Carrie really started the business uh, and then I joined her a year later. Um, and um, as they say, the rest is history, so. Yeah, would you um, be able to show us some of the things you've worked on and maybe um, tell us about some of your favorites? Yeah, so actually we, with um, all of the uh, virus situation, we have decided to really hit social media uh -huh. and we're, we're um, promoting our website quite a bit with sales. Uh, like this weekend, we were supposed to start a big art show, and because it got canceled, we decided to, um, since we're not paying for the art show, we decided to pass that savings on to customers. Mm -hmm. And so on our website right now, we're offering 20% off and free shipping. Um, and I'm sure you'll attend. The paintedgarden.com, right? Um, it's just paintedgarden.com. Okay. Yeah. Um, and that sale is going on through through April 16th, but I wanted to show you, these were orders that were taken over the weekend. Uh -huh. And so this is quite a variety that people have ordered. So we just have to get these boxed up and shipped for everybody. So you can see, you know, some people like to have their last names personalized. Some people really like wine. Go away, come back with wine. Uh-huh. The wine, Obviously a big seller over the weekend, which is kind of nice. And then um, that example that I showed you with putting the slate into the garden stand, uh, some people like to switch them out for the season. I was just explaining that with our different designs, people can switch them out for the seasons in their garden stand. So about how long does it take you to make one? Uh, we usually paint them almost like a, um, an assembly line type mm -hmm. format. So we're painting 22 of them at a time. And that way when one color is done, then 
Mike will do the next color and I'll do the next color and we kind of keep keep that process going. Okay. Do either of you have a favorite design or one that you like doing the most? Ooh, I would I would have to say that we we just started our we that flag bucket that I showed you. Mm -hmm. uh, that was a new design this past year and that that's been really popular. Um, you you can never tell what's going to be going to be the hit from from year to year. But a couple of years ago, our Christmas our red pickup truck with the Christmas tree out of the back that that was crazy popular and people still love it at the Christmas season. Right. Um, that, that would be on our website. Yeah. I don't think that was on the um, uh, the porch with all our orders. Uh, also, um, we do dog portraits. Um, uh -huh. Really popular I'm also. Gonna switch around the phone again. Um, <laughs> I, we don't do many canvases. That's an example of of a okay. custom done on slate. Go um, ahead, Mike. Very cute. As as I was saying, we don't do very many canvases, but here's here's one uh, a larger canvas that we just finished um, for a customer. Yeah. So. People just, um, maybe you want to see them in detail or something, but mm -hmm. um, people just actually send uh, the pictures via email or text, and then uh, we complete them here in the studio, and then ship them right to their door. So it's, it's very simple um, and um, you know, very easy for the customer. And the nice thing too is um, we, we'll take a uh, photo of the completed portrait and we'll send that to the customer before mm -hmm. we ship it so they can, um, they can see it before we actually ship it just to make sure they're satisfied. That's amazing. And, and how many of these can, do you guys do during a typical work day? Well, uh, this winter we, we really wanted to build up our stock. Mm -hmm. And so we would, we would paint, I was going to turn off these lights. We usually paint, um, sometimes 50 a day. Um, wow. but that's not every day. That was us getting ready for our spring art show season, which, um, since it's been canceled now, we're, we have a lot of stock in order to, uh, fill as soon as, you know, some orders come through our website and I'm able to get them finished and, you know, sent to the customer the same day. So uh -huh. that, that really, uh, that really makes a good impression. Um, the portraits we do, uh, one to two a day and we've done as many as four a day. Um, that's pushing it. Uh -huh. Yeah. <laughs> Just cause there's so much more detail obviously um, in the pet portraits. So we've done, we've done so many, we can do them fairly quick and, and with, there's with two of us working, um, we can crank them out pretty good. You guys said um, you kind of fell into this because um, your mom was doing it. Did you guys have an interest in art or an art background that, that kind of brought you to this or, or did it just well, happen for I, you? Well, <laughs> I, I, think, I think I absorbed the talent from my mom. Uh -huh. And it's the reason that Mike and I make such a great pair is that I'm, I'm a very quick painter and I can see like a, the overall picture now Mike has more um, art background, and so he's he's much better with detail. So I I stay away from the dogs, and I let him do all those. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I I'd, I'd never picked up. Well, I won't say never, but I hadn't done much painting um, before I met Carrie, and so she had to teach me, um, you know, painting techniques and that kind of thing. I was kind of like a, um, like a chimps, chimpanzee pushing <laughs> a pain around, you know, on a slate. But, um, you know, things have obviously changed over the years. And, um, um, you know, after 27 years, we've gotten to be pretty good at it. Yeah, yeah, that's a long time to be doing this. Um, and so the best way for people to find you would be through your website, yes? To, to place an order or to, to make a um, custom request? That is correct. Um, and as, as I said earlier, we're, we're working really hard on our social media. Uh -huh. 
And so daily we're making posts um, with videos of us painting, of you know, new designs, um, things like that. And so if, if you want to follow us on Facebook, mm -hmm. our Facebook is The Painted Garden. And then we also have Instagram, uh, Painted Garden. So that's kind of a fun way for people to follow us. The other new thing that we've added to our lives, which is pretty exciting, um, we used to do painting parties. So we would go to people's houses, they would have the party, I would bring the paints and the paint brushes and then people would, um, would paint a slate along with me. Mm -hmm. um, that human contact isn't really available anymore. Mm -hmm. So now we are offering online painting classes. Um, so about once a week, uh, sometimes twice a week, depending on if I have private parties, but we're doing uh, Zoom online painting parties. It's a great art therapy for people. Um, our, our last class, we painted tulips. Um, next week, we're doing a sunflower class. And we've also done events for like um, mothers to do with their children. And then it's also kind of nice because we also can send a painting kit to the grandparents. So it's kind of a nice way for for everybody to connect um, during this tough time. Yeah, that's fantastic. We'll be um, sure to include all those links um, on our at our virtual festival <laughs> and through our social sure. media too. So when you're doing those classes, um, we'd love to share them and and you know let people know. Absolutely, absolutely. I'm laughing. That looked like a like a light portal behind me or something. Yeah, you looked, <laughs> actually, you, no, you looked angelic. <laughs> you looked more so light. <laughs> I know these, these the Zoom interviews are great. <laughs> Is there um, anything else you'd like to uh, mention that I didn't ask about? No, we're very we're very sad to not be there this spring. We do have a lot of great customer base that come see us at that show, mm -hmm. and so um, yeah, we would we would love to see you on our website. Make contact with us, um, and you know they do they do make fantastic Mother's Day gifts. So. And we do guarantee them outside for 10 years. Um, so it's a gift that lasts a long time, which is nice. Um, and also, um, since we're local, um, we definitely invite people to visit us at the studio. I mean, they, they literally, we usually have one or two people come every week and they'll just, they'll just come into the studio and select something and we'll personalize it um, right here for them. And that takes about five minutes. Um, That's great. So, My arm's getting tired. Yeah. <laughs> That's an option too. And it's always, um, um, people generally like to see where the artists work and um, maybe they like to get to know us a little better and we like to get to know them. And um, So that's, um, that's an all, always an option. They just have to actually just visit our website um, and contact us that way, or they can, they're, they can call us our numbers on the website also, and they can call us and just make an appointment. Great, great. We'll, we'll make sure that all of that is accessible to everybody. And um, if I remember correctly, you guys are doing a live demo too, right? During the... Yes, we are. Yes. We'll, so We'll be in some paint during the art show, so. Okay, fantastic. So we'll see you there too. Very exciting. Um, Wonderful. Thank you both so much. I really appreciate you taking the time to talk with me and... Um, we're looking forward to our virtual festival. Wonderful. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. Bye now. Bye-bye.